by God's grace, we are kicking, except that our enemies are worrying. Mm, inshallah, because of them, we are here. You are here because of enemies? Because of the enemies. But, but, but the last time, I was interviewing someone, and the person said he went to tell his mom that he has gotten enemies in his work. Then that day, the mother said, oh, my son, you are blessed. They asked mother, why am I blessed? Because I have enemies who are disturbing my work. Then the mother said, the day you get enemies, it means you're going to grow and become a hero. Is it true? That one is true. Yeah, because of enemies. Yes, that's why I said, like, as, as you sit, you know, Mr. Benter, if your enemies disturb you, you know, then you come to me. I can help you to protect you. Then you'll be free. You you continue doing what you have always been doing and get your money and whatever you have and they also disturb me. You will continue doing your work. I got to the internet the bell. Subscribe for more. Yo, I go run a so you I go bring a so the awan so mra metie so so mo jeje mo eni ni wo mo mi bi san kemo so abo so so eni Christo so why di ene ye the great Tiberita Baba di ene gba Tiberita two Baba jeje ma ye mo ni wo eni Robert Benzo ye ti e wo ye ti e wo. Precious viewers, you are once again welcome to Akan TV. The show is Sunsum Shishemu, and we do this show to help people uplift in their spiritual state because we are an African. Once you are an African, you should know that as an African, things that makes you African are what we spend time teaching, lecturing, and also giving awareness i have here with me chief maragona he's one of the spiritualists over here in ghana and he's been helping people spiritually chief how are you fine thank you mr benter how are you too uh, by god's grace we are kicking except that our enemies are worrying mm, inshallah because of them we are here uh, you are here because of enemies. because of the enemies but, but, but the last time i was interviewing someone and the person said he went to tell his mom that he has gotten enemies in his work. Then that day, the mother said, Oh, my son, you are blessed. They asked the mother, Why am I blessed? Because I have enemies who are disturbing my work. Then the mother said, The day you get enemies, it means you're going to grow and become a hero. Is it true? That one is true. If, enemies? Yes. If you are not somebody, the enemies will not follow you. Unless the enemies will get to know that you are growing. That will be the time they will also start flow, flowing you. So, to be growing, you have to be serious in your life. Yeah. So, it's good to have enemies. And in fact, it, sometimes it's good because without enemies, you will not strike. Uh -huh. You will not be serious in your life. Yeah, you know, without enemies, it's two things. Whether you get some things cheap in your life, or if God not bless you like that, you will be, you will just growing down without striving to be grow. So if there is enemies following you, and you get to know that my enemies are disturbed, you also will fight with them. But 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 there's a saying in tree. That the upper moon bread, yeah, the one who is following you, he has not gotten tired. How are you going to rest? Because until he has gotten you, you also not going to rest. Too. Yeah, that's why I'm always said it. Prevention is better than cure. Just come to me. When you come to me, we have something called protection. To protect yourself, your enemies will throw the bullets to you, but it won't come to you. It won't catch you. He will be doing it, uh, by all means, he will be tired. You know, if you are fighting with something without getting it, and you are fighting it for so many years without getting it, by all means, you will be tired. But, but, but there must be a lesson. Suppose enemy is not following you. 
you won't waste time going to uh, achieve my guna for spiritual items so why are you creating enemies so that you waste money time and uh, uh, life that's why to I, save life that's why i said profession is better than cure don't waste until enemies following you before but the enemies who are there and we are saying the moment they follow you it means you are going to be a hero it means you are going to be a great person and following you too will also cost you uh you know sometimes they will follow you but they can't get you if you are serious for yourself to protect yourself very well they will be follow but they can't do anything people are having enemies but they don't think about them they don't even sleep to dream about the enemies it depends but the enemy how... will take you to uh, achieve my guna to kill you you know <laughs> chief my guna is not here for killing people like that no, I'm, I'm, I'm making emphasis no. that at least the, 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 the one who is who is your enemy uh, you know, will you take know, you to a juju man uh, you know enemies are always taking people to juju man to juju people that's why i said when you bring somebody to me i have to ask you the reason so when you bring somebody to me to do something against the person I will tell you if the person is your enemy doing something against you then I will remove it from you back to the sender but if only the person have a good job or person have something and it is pains you and you want the person to be lost it and you just been fighting like that I will mind you I will tell you the truth I will not do that way I'm not here for that to spoil people's life. But, but you, you initially said you are here because of enemies. Let's throw more light on it. Why are you here because of enemies? Yes, that's why I said, like, as, as you sit, you know, Mr. Benter, if your enemies disturb you, you know, then you come to me. I can help you to protect you. Then you'll be free. You, you continue doing what you have always been doing and get your money and whatever you have and they also disturb you you continue doing your work and they will still disturb you yourself because they may think that they will get you but they can't so I mean, so, 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 so you do this to help people yeah. out of enemies yeah hand. yeah 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 you know enemies they are they are they are very bad because Enemies to disturb you, he will not come and tell you that I'm your enemy. I'm coming to disturb you. He will not tell you that. So if you are not serious in your life to protect yourself, to also check up for yourself. If you are not lucky, enemy will catch you before Kura, you started roaming to remove yourself from there. That will be the time that you spend a lot. You spend your time, if, if you are not lucky, you still spend money a lot because if the enemies throw some sickness to you and sickness catch you already you must to be treated after treatment you must you must to be protective are you get me but just prevent yourself as you are not yet in that's why i said prevention is better, than, better cure. than cure yeah so that means you prevent and you kill yeah you cure. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's come to our work. Our work is spiritual things. Sometimes after giving people what they need, we also have to caution them. I initially said we are we are Africans. Yeah. And Africans, one thing that makes us African is our nature gods. Yeah. And you know, the respect we give to our nature gods is not like those overseas. We go over here, even our river bodies we destroy them but over there they don't you are a spiritualist what are you going to tell africans who are watching you how they will value what we have as an african uh, you know that's why we are here like the first time no uh, my forefathers who was been taking care of these spiritual powers before after me no? they wasn't know what is social media or something like that they wasn't know so because of that, people far away wasn't know what important about it. So they were doing whatever they have to do. But nowadays, that's why we are on social media. Let lecture the people to know what we are holding. This is this is what helps us to grow 
in Africa here. So we have to respect this, our spiritual powers, because that is the property that our forefathers leave to us. So we have to protect it and respect it so that it will help us like whatever. You know, nowadays that we can, when we need something from abroad, we can take a flight and whatever. We, ha we are now have optional to get to abroad. You know, olden days, our forefathers, to get that was not easy for them. So they were using this one to do whatever they want. So if we also come and respect these spiritual powers, we will also be blessed like those people, you know, our forefathers. You know. So nowadays, what I'm going to tell my brothers and sisters is that we have to respect this what we want. This one is God give to us. You know, because not white man that give to us. Is our own properties. So we have to prevent it. It will solve all our problems for us. Is it true that uh, a dwarf or a spirit can give money free, money into somebody's bank account free? Yeah, in fact, it's there. Yeah. It's there. Spirit will go and give money into somebody's account? Yes. How? Uh, it depends how the spirit like to, li likes you. You know, it's luckily somebody can dream, can sleep and dream and get a little number. Go and snap the stick the little. That one there. And, and we used the, to witness. Uh, yes, it's but, the but, same. But somebody will not go and work. You go and they say two million has been deposited into your bank account. Ebe. And in fact, that's why I say is spiritual <laughs> spiritual powers can do anything. Really? But yes, but it depends how you find it. Have you get me? It depends how you find it. You know, sometimes when God is going to give you something, God is not going to give you straight. It will be a reason that the things come to you. Uh -huh. Those people, people have been receiving money like that. Some people, they will be, they, especially those who are doing mobile banking. You know? Last time, one of my brother was received mobile money, about 30,000 from his accounts without need. Hmm. It's just a two Then months. why we don't get it so that we also witness? That's, why? Because it should, it should be somebody layman. So the person will testify. If it is you and yes, your brother, that my, how that, are you sure? That, the, 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 the one that I call my brother, no, it's not my family, but we are the same area. He's also a layman like you. <laughs> <laughs> we, are, we, are, we are area brothers. He's not my family. He's not my anything. But we are the same area. That's why I call him my brother. Yeah, so anything can is happen. That, is that darkness is catching us? So wrap up. What do you have for us in the end? Uh, in fact, what I have is only this, my medicines that I'm used to help my brothers who is far away from me. Those people in abroad, some, some people, HIV disturb them. Diabetes, hepatitis B disturb them. So whatever you find yourself with darkness, just take my number from the screen and call me or give me a voice message so that whatever I will give you the route that you can follow so that the things will get to you and use the medicine to cure your disease. Ah, your last word. And my last word is always one word. Prevent yourself well before something will happen to you. That's my last word. Prevention is better than kill. We are catch up with the darkness. As Africans, these are some of the things we should learn and we should do to help us. Let's end it here. We will continue next time. The name still remains Ben Robert. Thank you for watching. Hey, hey, hey. Yo, I'm free.